is Dr. Long Vo. And who is Dr. Julie Dow? I believe they're with Smile Center Dental outside of Toronto in Burlington, Ontario. We did a terrific interview with both of them for our Dental Top Doc Legends program because of the innovative work in dentistry that these folks are doing up they there. They have some groundbreaking work. And you're about to see one of the questions and answers that we asked them during our interview series. And then at the end, we have a lot more for you, so you want to stay tuned all the way to the end. Special offer coming for you. A very special offer. Stay tuned. Why do I need to take my baby to, for a visit to the dentist at Two Teeth? Now, I know in your program, and it's, it's very cleverly phrased here, two by four. So it's two, four times here, right? And early prevention dental health program. So two teeth is one of those times. Why do you say that's an important time for people, for mommies, to take their children to, uh, to the dentist? Uh, so those two first teeth are there, uh, and now it's, it's, uh, we need to learn how to take care of them. Uh, and uh, because uh, taking uh, care of two teeth is much easier than taking care of 20 teeth, that's the time where we should start learning. And prevention is all about uh, learning to do something before to prevent the problem, right? So we. We don't want to uh, buy a car and then get our license. We want to get the license first, know how to drive the car, and then we buy the car. So same thing, we want to know how to take care of two teeth first before all the 20 teeth come out. Uh, and it's much easier, and same thing, we, we are teaching the child that something uh, will be done to clean their teeth every night, and we'll be consistent about it. And once, uh, as all the other teeth erupt, it becomes a, um, a good pattern, a good behavior, and uh, it's so, so much more fluid because uh, the problem that we find is that the first appointment is, is a major appointment, such as uh, removing a loose tooth or... Uh, so many parents them. wait too long, don't they? And it's not their fault because yeah. no, nobody, nobody ever told them, them and that's, that's the purpose of this program, that we are trying to um, intercept all these uh, programs, uh, all these problems as early as possible, right? Uh, and uh, that uh, two teeth appointment is important because uh, it's something that's different. So there were no teeth and now there's two teeth. So uh, we want to make sure that uh, uh, mommy and, and uh, the parents know how to take care of those two teeth very well. And then when the other 20 come out, then we're ready to go. So baby's used to it, mommy and daddy are used to it. Uh, and it, it's just so, so much more smooth. And, uh, and at this experience. point, mommy can show you what she's been doing to clean the teeth yeah. for you yes. to either praise her or yes. help her learn a little better, yes. better way. Yes. And, and the nice thing about going to an appointment at this point is, this is not the time that a child goes and gets hurt. There's not a cavity yes. where there has to be a yes. drill going on. Starts to like the dentist, wants to go to the yes. dentist, wants to take care of the teeth properly. And it's a big help that way too, isn't it? Yes. Uh, at this stage, they may not really be aware too much of the dentist. And that's why it's also a good appointment for mommy. So that's where we can give all, all that information. And uh, so mommy can really, because it's, it's also about the diet, uh, of the child's diet and uh, uh, what, to, what to avoid as well, right? And uh, how, how to brush and what to avoid uh, to, to um, make sure the baby is, is healthy. So two teeth, that's yes. an important time. Yes. And so, Dr. Julie, one of the things I really love about your program is that you really are not only building good habits, but you're also building a relationship that's based on positive rather than scary things or hurtful things. And uh, hadn't really thought of uh, through that way, but as I'm hearing this, it really strikes me how important that is. And then I'm hearing two teeth, but I, I'm just kind of curious. I mean, those first teeth when they erupt, is it usually two? Or do, is it common to have one tooth or three teeth all at once? I mean, it's two. Um, the off wall, you may see one first, but usually they come in Pretty pairs. quick? Yeah. yeah. The, okay. Uh, mostly the bottom ones. They will be the first one to come in, and sometimes maybe one, sometimes maybe two. Um, but usually, you know, it's to give the, the mom or the parents a chance to um, show them in person because it's one thing to say do this and do that. Right, to read it on the, a label it, or on in a In reality is that if, you know, let's say the, the, the child is not behaving or is not allowing or they actually have to try to do it mm -hmm. um, to be comfortable as well um, because a lot of parents may be reluctant to putting something in, a, in the, the baby's mouth. We'll see if they haven't start wiping the gums. Mm -hmm. um, you know, just for them to have a feel and sure. to be comfortable with that. 
and that's the best way to, to show them. Um, it's much easier to um, try to do that on a six, seven months baby as opposed to when they, they're much older and they're going to fight back and the arms and the legs are going to start and swinging. Clear, <laughs> clearly much easier and more positive an experience yes. than when they're coming in to, for the first time dealing with a problem yes. instead yes. of and, you know, prevention. You know, when the, the first two teeth have just erupted, there's no problems yet. There's right. no cavities yet. So, you know, this is why it's so important to set it early on. Has anyone managed to do that, get a cavity in their first two teeth before, they, <laughs> before uh, any other teeth? Somebody's tried really hard to eat nothing but sugar? Could, could it be done? Um, not <laughs> we, we, wouldn't, if, if, we wouldn't encourage yes, the competition. You know, no, <laughs> definitely not. Um, but, you know, bring them in the minute you start to see the two teeth that, that have come in, bring them in so mm -hmm. we, we catch that. They're still healthy and uh, we, we can avoid so much problem. And also, um, you know, remind the parents about um, certain type of diet, certain food that may make the, the child be more prone to decay. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, it's a good opportunity to review that with the parents as well. Whoa, Dr. Mark, that's a good answer there to that question. That was terrific, but that's just the beginning. We have so much more to give you here. Where do we have more to give you here? DentalSecrets101.com. DentalSecrets101.com, what do we have there? There we have a. Hey, we have the entire interview that this was just one question from, but that's just the beginning. We have the Dental Secrets 101 special report. Oh, you do want to get that. That's a Absolutely. downloadable right away. You can get all these questions and answers, some new ones, some other information. Lots of information to take care of your dental health and the dental health of your family. But you're also going to get an ongoing newsletter with great tips for your dental health and taking care of your kids. But the interview is going to be terrific because it is just lots and lots of information with two dentists. And every time we add another series of these, we add it to the same thing. So you may find there's a lot more there than you even think is there. So if you liked this question and answer, now's the time to get even more. So click on that link that's down below, Dental Secrets 101, and get all of this plus so much more.